All right, hope you guys are having a good time. I'm going to do some quick important announcements which we didn't do yesterday, and then we'll continue with the program after that. Uh, quite a few people have asked me if uh, we're going to be giving the videos and the slides to the participant. How many people want them? Awesome. <laughs> So as you can see, we are video recording both the sessions in this hall and the other hall, and they will all be uploaded on YouTube. It will be available for free, so you can go view them. Probably take us about two months to get them. That's our past experience. It takes about two months to process all of them and get them online. But we'll try our best to do it in a week's time. That's what the vendor has told us, so we'll try for a week. But uh, take it as at least a month before they'll show up. All right. Uh, I'd request all the speakers uh, who have given sessions over here to please uh, upload your slides uh, on SlideShare or anywhere else you like, and then just update your proposals, uh, the proposals that you put in Confident. Please update your proposal. There is a link in that. You can add your slide link. As soon as you add it, it will show up on the schedule, right? And then people can download the slides from there. So request all the speakers to please upload your slides and then share the link via your submission that you had put in the proposal submission. OK, so that way you will get the slides as soon as the speakers upload it, and then the videos in a month's time. When the videos are uploaded, the same place the, where we have the schedule, you will be able to see a link from there for all the videos as well. Right? So that's about the uh, slides and videos. I'd also like to thank uh, an, one of our sponsors, which I didn't mention yesterday, Appy Tool Eyes. Uh, we have uh, our friend over here from Israel. Uh, Appy Tool has also sponsored this conference, uh, so thank you guys. Uh, what else we have? So quickly talk about uh, Bug Bash. Uh, not sure how many people have popped in and seen what's going on. Uh, so far, as we checked this morning, we have 85 bugs that have been reported via the bug bash, which I think is a fantastic first step. <laughs> and we thought we would actually announce, uh, instead of announcing at the end, we actually will announce one of the winners now, and then we'll announce two more winners in the evening. Uh, so is Vinitar here? Vinitar. I know she was filing bugs till about 27 minutes ago. <laughs> All right, we don't see her. Uh, probably we'll give the prize away to her in the evening. We have three Raspberry Pi kits to be given away. So she's already claimed one. There are two more to be claimed. Uh, what we are seeing so far is people are reporting bugs. What we would like to see is, uh, you know, Reporting bugs is great, but if you can submit an automated test along with it, that would be fantastic. So I know a lot of people have forked the repo and they've started creating uh, tests, but they've not committed back. Once they, As soon as they commit, we would know. So we are pushing the cutoff time. We had a cutoff time at 11 today, but we are pushing the cutoff time till 2. Uh, so you have time up till 2 to submit your bugs and uh, you know, automated tests. Uh, also, in addition, what would be fantastic is, uh, like for example, wherever possible, if you can actually submit a solution, right? That's even better, right? You submit a bug, but you also submit the solution. That's even better. So we encourage you guys to try that out. Julian, anything else you want to add, please? So for some of you, it's going to be hard to fix the software, which is fine. Uh, but for translations, for instance, people file a bug saying um, this text isn't translated into Telugu. We'd really, really like you to help us translate the bits that aren't translated in the software. I don't speak Telugu, nor do any of the other developers, so we can't do this by ourselves. So if you can help us with that, I'll submit the code, and uh, we can actually get it into the next build. And therefore, all the rest of the users can get it as well. So please help us with that. Thank you. Uh, lastly, I would like to acknowledge one person who has been helping us with all the logistics over here. Uh, do you find any problem with the logistics so far? No? 
That's great. Very good. I'd like to welcome my brother Deepak, who's actually been organizing all the, right from the kits, the registrations, all the logistics over here. Trust me, it's a lot of effort, a lot of sleepless nights. So thank you, Deepak, for being there. Thank you, everyone, for making this conference a great success. Thank you. All right, so we're going to break now for a coffee tea break, and then we're going to be splitting the rooms, and we're going to kickstart the rest of the day. Thanks again, and we will see you back together here at 4 o'clock for Julian's keynote. Uh, there are two more quick announcements. Really sorry about that. As usual, I forget stuff. Uh, so two more quick announcements. We have about 40 winners of uh, a nice gift that the Browser Stack guys have. Uh, they're going to be giving it away during the lunch. So there are about 40 winners for a nice gift. So you can go by at lunchtime at Browser Stack stall and collect the prizes. The winners will be announced on their side. Uh, we also have an uh, iPad winner, an uh, iPad mini winner uh, at the uh, stall with the Eureka guys. And uh, they're going to be announcing, I believe one of the committers is going to uh, pull out the name and announce the winner. Again, that's going to happen at lunchtime at uh, the second stall. All right? Thank you, guys. Sorry.